Good morning, everyone. Welcome to NAS Daily News. I'm Jari Mad. And I'm Fruit from Grade 8. Let's check out the headlines for today. The student of Grade 8 presented the science project. The math department held a virtual math competition last week. Millions of visitors to join Expo 2024 in Dubai and online. Dubai bonds, new trend of serving coffee and baby feeding bottles. Bani Yas beats Kalba Al Ain hold Al Al Wasal in Dubai Arabian Gulf League. Temperature to drop, strong winds, blowing dust expected. Let's go to the news. In school news, the students of Grade Eight presented the science project. Last week, students of Group A presented their science project in the class. They researched on various topics and made a presentation. Let's check out some videos from the class presentation. For you, how the earth is the revolution around the sun, and how he is getting for us the four seasons spring, summer, winter, autumn. Here, we will talk about how the summer it is uh... the math department held the online math compet competition last week. The competition was taking place. 1st of March, online student from grade 4 till 12 participate. In UAE news, millions of visitors to join Expo 2020, both in Dubai and online. The Dubai Expo 2020 will run on a hybrid model offering, both physical as well as virtual experiences to visitors in the UAE and around the world. To Due to the outbreak of COVID-19, since its inspection, Expo 2020 Dubai has committed to harnessing cutting-edge technology to provide visitors with an enriched experience, both on-site and, where, and wherever they may be in the world, say, said an Expo 2020 spokesperson. Dubai bans new trend of serving coffee in baby feeding bottles. Authorities in Dubai have directed coffee shops to shop serving be beverage in baby bottles. The Dubai economy said the practice is against local custom. It also wanted the safety measures in uh, place against the spread of COVID-19. In sporting news, Bani Yas B. Kalba Al Ain uh, hold Al Wasal in Arabian Gulf League. Second half goals help Benias earn a 2 0 victory away from home over the Hat Kalba in match week 19 of the Arabian Gulf League on Saturday. Few chances were created on both sides in the first half, which ended in a goalless draw. The second half, however, was eventful as it saw two goals at the Red Cup. Benias raised their tally to 39 points and moved temporarily to second place above Sharjah, who still have a a game in hand. Meanwhile, Etihad Kalba remained in ninth place with 26 points. And when the news, temperature to drop strong winds blowing dust expected. The temperature is likely to fall according to the NCM. The forecast to, uh, for today is fair in general during daytime, while being partly cloudy and hazy. At times, with a slight fall in temperature, the NCM said, that's it for news today. I hope you guys have a great, great day. Stay safe, stay, stay healthy. healthy.